And we are live. Hey, everybody, and welcome to our live. You can see that we have here with us Sean Clark. He is the co-founder. He is the CEO. He is the awesome top dog from high level. Uh, and we are really, really fortunate. For those of you that missed it, and you can see that Amy and I both have our high level hats on. And for those of you that missed it, high level had their first annual event, in-person annual event um, last week. They've had their level up days for a few years, but they but they uh, but they now had this event, and they announced so 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 much stuff. That was last week. Um, Sean is coming on here to talk to us about it. But um, as I've said to some of you already, we want to hold his feet to the fire. We want to understand, you know, what this means for you, um, because there's lots of stuff for the you know huge big agencies, the huge big SaaSpreneurs out there with hundreds and thousands of clients, but what about for the people that aren't quite at that level? What is important? What can we take away? Uh, I know that there are a number of you that have already reached out to me and say, hey, should I hold off on going through your your, your training? Should I, should I hold off on signing up for high level? Should I hold off on this? Because they're about to release stuff. Well, then they have just released stuff. And what's important <laughs> for me and what should I do? So we want to dive into that and see if you should or shouldn't hold off. If you are... Um, whether you should dive in now, whether you should wait, what is important? And I already know the answers to those questions. And I know that Sean does, does too, but we want to take you through it. We want to explain that to you guys. And we want to go through that. So, you know, we're, we're, we're going to let Sean come, come in and talk to you about it. And he's got stuff that he can share. He's going to, he has taken a lot of time out of his day. He's, he's in between appointments and he's in the car. Um, but he's coming at us anyway. He's going to cover this stuff. So we are really, really fortunate. Today is Tuesday. They just finished their event. We are one of the first places that Sean is coming on to after Level Up. Um, yep. and, he's getting, and, he's, and, he's, and he's come to us to share all of this and go through that. So we are really excited. We are really grateful that Sean, after, you know, it must be a manic month for you. And I'm sure then that you've got a whole oh. bunch of work to catch up from that oh, you weren't able to do. Yes because of everything so we're really really grateful thank you so 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 much for taking the time in between appointments in the car to get on with us and go through this we we really yeah, are very happy grateful. to be here thank you for having me this is awesome yeah so like you said we had a great event it was awesome but you know i whether we have an event or not i'm all about the features and the things that we're adding to the product so i think what we should probably do is i've got the blog here and this is available to anybody just blog.gohighlevel.com and uh, it's got all of the level update announcements on it. And I thought maybe it'd be a great idea to start here, cover it with you, kind of go over all the um, all the things that I think are kind of the highlights um, and to pay attention to. And then, you know, you can obviously go back and go crazy and read it all. But um, I think the first thing that I, I, we just go this, through this in order here. The first thing I just want to show you is the company object. So this is only important because we're really continuing to enhance the CRM quite a bit. And the company object is big if you're going into B2B. So if you run into a company that sells to other companies, this is kind of a key aspect of a CRM. So it's just the idea that, listen, you can create a company, you can have different people and associate with them with the company natively. So now you've got that company object. That's really all there is to it. But if you ever work with somebody who's a manufacturer or somebody who is working with B, kind of B2B clients, this is kind of an, a, a have to, right? Um, some cool stuff on the conversation filters. And honestly, all this stuff is useful. I'm just going to skip anything that I don't think is like hardcore SaaSpreneur kind of, you know, like small agency sale, selling something new to your client kind of thing. TikTok integration, massive. If you haven't heard about this yet, TikTok is huge. It's huge for everyone. In fact, one of our speakers said, uh, you know, that you would think TikTok's about teenagers, but he's literally selling HVAC jobs for his HVAC clients off TikTok. So we now have an integration with TikTok. It basically makes it just like Facebook lead ads. You're running a lead ad essentially on TikTok. It now comes into the system. You can do the same automations you could before. So check that out. Very, very cool feature. Very yeah, nice this is super cool. Don't don't underestimate this in, in your, your sales process because you, you can talk about the future where these businesses need to go. Maybe you don't offer TikTok ads. Um, maybe, you know, it's something that the customer needs to go and do themselves. Uh, maybe you want to outsource it, it somewhere, but but either way, it's showing that you've that you've thought through where the future of what they need is. And I, and I think that's a really, really important part. Even if tick, even if you've never been on TikTok, you know nothing about it, you can still sell the fact that you have this integration. Yeah, absolutely. I think that's super key. Um, here's a roadmap for the CRM. The only thing I was going to highlight here real quick is the two-way two -way email sync. So we'll have this out this quarter. It's the ability to basically sync with Gmail and Outlook. So when you send an email in Gmail, if it's attached to a contact in the system, it automatically pulls that email in. So you can really keep that contiguous thread with that converse, uh, with that contact. Just that simple, super nice CRM feature nice, out nice. later. 
bunch of other stuff too. Um, definitely check it out. Calendar stuff. So recurring appointments are coming out. They're actually in QA right now. Uh, they'll be coming out this quarter. Uh, obviously, we've got collective scheduling. So it's the ability to actually schedule, take two people or multiple people on a staff, kind of gloom together, and then present out to the world a booking widget that when I book, I end up booking with one, two people, three people, four people, um, sort, of, sort of simultaneously. It's kind of an advanced uh, feature. Uh, that's also useful. And then adding guests. So if you want to be able to have an appointment and add a guest to it, just like you can in Gmail or Outlook, you can do that. So that's kind of cool. Nice, nice. Um, Super amazing SaaSpreneur feature here, Google LSA ads, the ability to book an appointment with a business right off of Google. Uh, super amazing. Uh, it's in the home services niche. So home services is big, okay? Chimney sweeps and plumbing and HVAC and I mean, you name it, lawn mowing, that's all home services for Google. Um, also real estate and legal. So any of those, they have these released now. Basically, I'm going on Google. I'm searching plumber near me. I'm seeing all the plumbers. I see this. I see your plumber. They've got this booking link. I can literally click it and book an appointment. I've never left Google. This is like delivering appointments to your customer, quite literally. And they can't do it without you. So I sometimes I get these weird, just for the record, even if someone can do something themselves, when someone says to me, like, I don't get it. How am I providing any value? Like, you, of course you're providing value. Like there's lots of stuff we can all do for ourselves that we don't. And we don't think the person doing it is not providing value. It's saving us a lot of time, right? But Google LSA stuff, you can't do without a partner. So they need you to do this. They can't actually do this on their own at all. So this is amazing. Booking appointments right off Google for your customer. Great feature. Um, May I ask a quick question on that, Sean? Yeah, fire away. I actually, I just, I actually just use that feature not within high level but i use that feature on google this weekend actually oh, to book, imagine that no, no to book a reservation for at a restaurant mm -hmm. so it wasn't um okay so i just wanted to throw that out there i don't yeah, know yeah. if that's part yeah of yeah, yeah. No, that, that, yeah yeah so that's coming so they're so um they are opening this api up slowly and so we've gotten okay. access to these three categories and i think restaurants is next um so but you've done yeah, it, right? it was so how would you not do that yeah, yeah, yeah. It was That's sleeping. It. it was amazing. Yeah. Well, very, cool. very cool. And okay. and 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 just think about the local SEO aspect of this as well. Who would go? Who are Google going to push to the top? The people that are keeping people on Google and booking on Google, just like the 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 messenger chat that 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 you've now got in there. Then you've got these local service ads. Google are going to push this. They and they will want adoption of this. So if people are using this, they're going to push it to the top. So you, there's a massive local SEO perspective that goes with this. Absolutely. Absolutely. Calendar stuff, recurring appointment stuff, automation stuff. Again, all this is amazing. Please check it out. But um, uh, goals, huge, huge workflow automation concept here. If you don't know what a goal is, it's really simple. It's like, hey, listen, when this thing happens, I want to jump over to this goal, right? So when this goal is met, I want to, I want to, I want to fire off right here. Um, uh, it's a big part of CRM or sorry, excuse me, workflow automation. Go check it out when you get a chance. So that's in there. Um, this is the worst slide of this entire blog and one of the best features. Um, love it. Um, so this is literally, let me see if I can actually go over and, um, this has, this has huge potential for a lot of people. Oh, totally agree. So, uh, oh, while I'm actually, while I'm here, might as well skip this over, is cool too. roll up reporting. So you can actually see all the stats across all your sub accounts. Isn't that amazing? Um, I'm doing this off my phone internet. So, you know, this will be, I'm sure this will be really cool. This will be super, super fast. Oh, whoa, it is really fast. Look at that. Um, Wow. Amazing. Okay. So basically this is super simple. When you go into a funnel like this, let's go out of step. Wow. Nothing like doing this on the fly. Come on, let's do it. Um, so when you go in and you're going, so a couple of things all in one. So one, we now have native video hosting in high level. Wow. That right there is amazing. That would be a feature announcement unto itself. But so look at this. So now whoop, wrong thing. Elements, add elements. As you can see, I'm not a funnel builder. Okay. So now down here, what can we do? We can go in and we can choose hosted video. Now I can come in, I can host, I can grab my own video. I don't even know so, what this and, is. And so, so now I don't need YouTube or Vimeo or Wistia. No, 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 no. Like it's all that. native, I can right? upload it straight into high all level. Native. I can host my video there. That's awesome. Totally. And this right here is like a major announcement, right? But it gets even better. So yeah, uh, that, that on its own is awesome. Let alone this bit that you're going to go on. Totally, to totally, page. totally. So um, you got that. Let's, I don't even know what this video is. So um Hopefully it's not. Oh, cool. There you go. So that's awesome. Now, what you can do here is besides all the cool switches, but down here, see this redirect to unregistered visitors. 
it's the weirdest little option, but it's the coolest option. So imagine the following situation. You want to show video content to someone who's registered, but let's say I find this URL or someone sends it to me or whatever, but I haven't registered yet. If I try to hit this URL, you can say, no, 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 buddy. I'm going to redirect you back to the opt-in step. So you're gating this content only to the people who, is re who have registered. This is a huge feature, okay? And once you do this, now what do we have? We have this great page. It's got a video. So, so that, that, that's, a, that's a whole release aspect on its own as well. That oh, part. So, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. so on video, you've done hosted yeah. video. You've done you've done the gating content. And now you're going to go on to a third bit that all of this exactly, is amazing. Exactly. On its own. And then the next thing you want to do is you want to know if some people are actually doing anything about this, right? So you can literally go into workflows and you can create a workflow action where you, you say, listen, on video view, right? So if they've a video tracking here, you can say, listen, if they've viewed X percent of my video and we don't actually have to go through all this, but um, is, I guess it'll work. Oh, look at that system is so smart. Man, this, this we're just getting so much. So like if they viewed 50% and you could say like greater than or equal to, so like greater than or equal 50%, do something. So we've, we've driven something into a page. We know who they are, whether we know if they're watching our video and boom, if they hit that tripwire, we can react to it. We can do something with it. This is a really cool, advanced sort of funnel automation kind of concept. So all across the board here, you got your triple play. This is a great feature. I'm super pumped that we got this out. This is a, this is amazing. And and then, you know, so we can then um, send them follow-up texts. We can send them emails. We can do all that, all that sort of thing. We can have, we our, can, we can can have we... our salesperson magically ring them up and say, hey, how's it going? You ready to buy? Yeah, you know, like, we can, I don't know and, what to talk about. Like, actually, I do. I just saw that you watched half our video. Ha ha. I think we can, we can, we can use the Facebook conversions API to fire stuff back then as well to say that we've got it. That's done, really on, smart, on, on, actually. On, I think that's probably ads. better, actually. Yeah, just uh, hit, them, um, hit them up. Yeah, conversion API, we can then add them and delete them from custom audiences as well. And, exactly. you know, the sky's, the sky's the limit. And I'm perhaps talking a lot more advanced stuff than... Way you know, more advanced. Then, oh, yeah, then, you got then, the, you got the some picture. people are doing here, but yeah, it's yeah, yeah. the potential. I um, know, I know, I know. So um, so uh, do we have some questions to jump into real quick before we keep going? Go ahead, fire you, away. Where do I look? Yes, we've uh, we've probably got them on Facebook. Do, okay, do you, perfect. you got them, Amy, or I can... Yeah, here we them. go. Okay. Um, okay, Anna is asking, um, well... <laughs> Recurring calendar and recurring appointments. Did you already go over that? Or yes, is I that did. Hold on. It's in QA right, right now, recurring I believe. Appointments? It's in QA. In QA. So okay. normally, am, am I right when someone's in QA within a week or two, if it all goes right? Exactly. You got it. Exactly. Um, Arnold is asking, to be clear, I can have paid content on here and it will not be pirated. Uh, that is a very broad question. So... We we are certainly going to do everything we can to ever keep your content. It's not going to be easy to pirate your content, right? So at some point, if just so everybody knows, if you're delivering any kind of video from any system in the entire universe to the local machine, at some point, there is a way, if you're really smart, to, to, to grab it. But the vast majority of people, no, absolutely not. You won't be able to do it. Now, it does. It streams, which makes it really hard to actually download and grab. So it doesn't come down as a big file. We stream it down in little bits. So, it's, it, I mean, you'd have to like have Wireshark and I don't know. I, in fact, I'm not even sure that's possible as well because it's encrypted. So I just say it's going to be gosh darn hard. It's so I'm going yes to his question, but I just, I'm a software engineer. So I like to be very detailed when it comes yeah, to it's, it. It's, 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 someone anywhere can can get something or they can screen record yeah, something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you it's know, you're, like, you, you're, uh, you're, you're, you're Nobody's ever a hundred percent, but yeah, it's pretty yeah, it's, awesome. You know, there's, the there's a deadbolt on the door, but you know, if they drive a Mack truck through it, you know, there's not a deadbolt on the planet that's going to stop that. Yeah. So at the end of the day, it's as secure as you can make it. Yeah. Arnold is saying, got it. Thank you. Uh, it's awesome. Goodbye, Kajabi. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we said, we said right. goodbye, Kajabi a long time ago. I'm with you. Yes. All right. Foz is asking, would Google guarantee API? Yeah. Uh, uh, boy. Uh, I'm really. It's, I think it's about opening understand. up for health clinic booking apps and other restrictions. We're working, on we're, that. We're, yeah, we're banging on the door with Google. Um, so uh, the more adoption we get, the more attention we get from them. Uh, but I think that we are actually up. They're doing something on this. I got to go back and look at my notes. But we've got a big tie up with them coming up. I think in Q1. Um, I think they're they're doing some kind of like pause on rollouts and then they'll resume in Q1. I think we'll get restaurants and health clinics um uh in in q1 to a broader set of partners and we'll definitely be there to to pick it up i love just for the record on the booking side i love this because 
you know, I'm so tired of the days where people are like, oh, I've got this CRM and that CRM and this system and that system. Can you do like integrations with it for booking and all that? I love that Google is going to create just this solid across the board platform. And, and, you know, it used to be, well, you know, it doesn't do this or it doesn't do that. But at some point it's like, listen, hi, my name is Google. I've got 99.9% .9 of local search traffic in the world. Would you like to play my game or would you like to go broke? You know, it's like, go hang out with your CRM <laughs> in the basement and, and go broke or come out and, you know, just play the game on Google and win. So we're gonna be there, we're gonna be part of it and we're gonna make sure all of you are there as well. Yeah, Terry is asking, and I think we already covered this, just so you guys know, we we jumped right in. Uh, Terry, uh, he said, did I hear Gmail native integration was coming? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, 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 absolutely. So we'll have uh, Gmail native integration, both uh, on the on this two-way sync side um, and also on the sending side uh, as well. All right, I'm gonna Perfect. keep rolling. So uh, SaaS market reports, cool, all kinds of um, good metrics. I'll tell you though, here's the punchline. People who sell SaaS make more money. That's it, moving on. Um, all kinds of cool stuff about- how, those, how to, are, those stats are amazing. If people are interested, go yeah, back yeah, and-, yeah. and, 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 and so Nothing in here is not amazing, but yeah. I was told, look, man, stick to the good stuff, stick to the highlights. So that's what I'm doing. Um, you know, lots of enhancements on helping you sell SaaS, protect yourself with SaaS, scale your SaaS, all that stuff, right? And, um, you know, coupons are in here and stuff. That's awesome. Uh, we're going to now something to talk about here. Um, the ability to create unlimited SaaS plans is coming uh, this quarter and the ability to do multiple brands is also coming this quarter. So this is the ability to say, I want, I want to have a SaaS company called Plumber Soft and another one called Lawyer Soft. I want to run them all simultaneously in the same uh, high level account. And I want to have 357 different SaaS plans because I think that's super important. Um, and I would say you're nuts, but that's fine. You'll be able to do all that this quarter. So that was well, all. We, well, we have, we have a lot of people that want to niche down, but they want to niche down to a few niches. So this will that, really that's what the multiple uh, brands will let you do. Yeah, allow them to do it. And then, of course, if you want to niche down properly with them, you probably want to give them a snapshot that's maybe got a plumber funnel or website in it, yep. and then a carpet yep, yep, cleaner yep. funnel or website in it. Well, you you struggle to do that from the SaaS perspective right now because you can only really add one snapshot per piece so, oh we know yeah there, oh, there, know. there are workarounds but let, let me tell you another cool thing that's coming though um also is per contact pricing and per user pricing so this is you know the way i think about it is like if you come across like the the cheapest quote unquote and i want to be very very sure you understand these are air quotes CRMs will try to pull sneak attacks on you like, oh, it's only $10 a month, like for one user and 500 contacts, because they know that they get you in there and you actually have 10,000 contacts and bam, you're paying 300 bucks. But I understand sometimes people kind of get head faked by that. And so we're going to give our people, our customers, the ability to do that same head fake. So that way, if they have to, they can go toe to toe with anybody who's pricing that way and create those same tripwires. So it'll give you the ability to, to appear um, less expensive than the 97, but not actually be fundamentally that cheap, you know, fundamentally cheaper. Because again, our goal, right? Our aim is to make sure that we're providing you enough revenue through the door to properly support your clients and selling it for $10 a month. Let me tell you, it does not do that. But I understand sometimes you get into competition with people. So we want to give you a, a path for that. So anyways, per contact pricing, per user pricing coming this and, quarter. And are, are you adjusting the the map, the minimum advertised pricing that people can can do it um, um, in line well, with that? Yes, sort of. In the sense that we will have, we will have, uh, trying to think about the, the way to think about this. We'll have uh, ceilings, not floors, um, mm -hmm. based on the price. So you won't be able to give unlimited contacts and unlimited users and all that yes. we will, we will, hard, we, will, we will absolutely keep you from hurting yourself um yeah. but again we want to provide different pricing structures to help you very so cool very cool so that's out there da, 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 da. oh yeah okay lead connector phone system this is a big deal um we did this on phones we did this on email simultaneously this is a simple idea that we're taking twilio and mailgun we're putting them behind the scenes we're we're wrapping it in front of them we're taking care of all the compliance we're, we're doing a ton of protections here again. So somebody comes in, signs up for your SaaS, sends out a, wants to send out a 30,000 list blast and cost you a bunch of money, has no money and violate a bunch of rules all at the same time. We're going to stop that. The LC phone system is going to come in. It's going to give them a ramp period, which you can override if you manually, if you have a good customer, but by default is going to be in place. It's going to- that, And that, that ramp is still pretty, pretty large. Like most customers coming in and not going to even notice that it's there. Yeah, you no, know, that's, any the, genuine that's the idea, right? These are, these are, these are trap doors to grab 
either bad actors um, mm -hmm. on purpose or bad actors by accident. And I've seen them both, right? I've seen really good customers come in and say, what do you mean I can't just buy a random list on the internet of a million names and blast out an SMS to all of them and they're all going to buy? Like, you know, people are dumb, but they, they're not doing it on purpose, right? So, but I've seen them both ways. This will stop that. It'll protect you. It'll protect them. And then also um, all the all the billing is instantaneous. So Twilio has this delay in the billing system. And it, because upstream, you got to realize there's different carriers and they have to figure out different charges and they have to do all this stuff. And that's wonderful. But if you're out a thousand bucks in that delay period, that's not going to work. So what we did is we do all the billing um, locally. And then we just basically, once the billing comes in from Twilio later, we kind of do a comparator to see if we missed you know, a penny here, a penny there. But in, what that does is it creates instantaneous billing so that the wallet on your client side draws down quickly. So if they're running a big list, they don't have money on their card, it, you're gonna they're gonna get stopped quickly. It's gonna pause the campaign. It's gonna force them to update the card. So that way as an agency, you're not gonna get, be out a lot of money um, and things are gonna be always looking good for you. So that is all part of the lead connector phone system and email system. Um, and then, oh, and then on the phone system side, we're 10% cheaper than Twilio. So there's a ton of stuff in here for you um, on, on the uh, phone system side. So that's all that. Yeah, and, and, and we switched a while ago on the, on the beta for the phone system. So we've been, we've been using that ourselves for, for Perfect. a so while. You, and you and had no problems. All that. Excellent. Yeah. On the lead. Hey, I just want to pop oh. in. I'm oh, yeah. sorry. So, pop so, in. sorry no, no, pop in. I just want to pop in here. We've had a bunch of new people pop in recently. Um, Sean is going through um, a document that you can go find. Uh, you look at his URL right now. Blog. Just go to blog.gohighlevel.com. Blog. Blog. No need to look at the whole URL. It's like one of the first articles. I think it's either the first or the second now. Um, and, uh, and and so you're, yeah, just come check it out. You can look at everything I'm looking at. And I'm also dropping individual videos on YouTube this week for each of these major features that's going to go in depth on them, all that, all that good stuff. So don't worry about yeah, all that. We're, we're only focusing right now because Sean has a very limited time frame with us. So we're focusing on the highlights that smaller agency um, and SaaS folks will really want to use and know Absolutely. about. So I just wanted Absolutely. to give you a heads up. Thank you very much for doing that. I appreciate that. So lead connector email, same sort of thing. You don't need mail gun anymore. It's all gone. Um, we're also um, doing a bunch of migration stuff and all that, but um, cool things here that I would, I want to give you a heads up to. Um, so custom domains will be out here momentarily. I think in the next two weeks, um, email validation. This is really key for two big, important reasons. One list health. You don't want to have a bunch of spam going out because otherwise you get a bad reputation. You could turn this on and it's a moneymaker. So you can now bill your clients an upcharge for the validation. You can make a lot of money doing that. We're, um, we're turning the, we're turning that on for every client right now. And hey, nice there's just a few extra, few extra, you know, it's not, you're not going to get super rich, but you know, every little bit adds up when you look at uh, all the different, the all yes. the different rebilling aspects and it all adds up. And, and, and you'll see in some of Sean's stats that we, that we probably missed, Absolutely. but the, but the, but the average agency makes over two hundred dollars a month in rebilling. Now, I I, I think that's low because we make way more than 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 that. But the, but the point is, the cost of the upgrade from the two ninety seven to the four ninety seven is more than paid for just by the rebilling for most agencies oh, out yeah. there or m most SaaSpreneurs out there. So Absolutely. so you know your upgrade is paid for. Boom. Mm -hmm. Good point. So now, um, heads up, what's coming? The other thing I want to, okay, we got a bunch of stats and that those are amazing. Dedicated IPs are coming this quarter. Again, um, another way to to, to do um, even better, higher sending rates, really move, create a single channel reputation, but also another upsell opportunity. Um, and I think that's going to be awesome. Smart sending, some other stuff like that, but go read that, figure it out. That's that's not Sasspreneur necessarily. Membership stuff. Membership stuff is huge. So we did all this already, in-app upsells and all this and themes, comments. These are amazing, but white label learner this is huge. Um, again, these slides are terrible. I don't even know um, where they came from. But what this is, is this is a custom white label app for your sub account for their memberships. And so this is like, again, to the person who said about Kajabi, imagine you go to the mobile app store, you download the Kajabi app. Well, now it's all under their name. This will be all under your name, right? And, and, and more importantly, it'll be under the name of the sub account that you're working with. So if you have a coach, and this, and they have coaching program and they have people in the memberships. This is their app. It's got their branding, their colors, their customization. Let me, let me, let, let me give everyone an example of this. If you, if you are part of the profit pact and you have one of our courses, and if you've not go to theprofitpact.com right now, sign up and you'll get it. Open it up on your phone, go open it up on your phone and you will be prompted 
to add this as an app to your phone. So I want you to guys to go and check it out, see what it's like, because I also yeah. want you to have Very our cool. app on your phone. So use us as an example. Go get our app on your phone, thebookpack.com, like log in. You will see exactly how that works and how people can have your app on their phone. It's insane. That is insane. And um, and 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 I didn't have to pay any extra for that. I know. That's right. It's free. And so quizzes. Quizzes are live. I haven't even done a video on this, but you can do quizzes now in the memberships, which is amazing. New membership theme um, as well. You can see some other stuff that's coming. It's going to be awesome. Um, let's see, snapshots. The thing I want to, the only thing I really want to highlight here is social planner or in snapshots. So that means if I have a bunch of social media posts in my snapshot, I can now push them down to all the link to sub accounts. It wasn't there before. It's there now. That's awesome. That's pretty cool. Uh, so, so, so if, if you've got a plumber client, you go after plumbers, you can, you can preload them with a bunch of social templates for plumber content that are already in the snapshot to then launch. Absolutely. Um, coming nice. this quarter, uh, dedicated snapshot share links. This is a terrible title. It basically means I can't use your snapshot link outside of your subdomain, meaning you can lock it. So I can't take this over my domain. I can't sign up for high level myself and take it with me. It gives you exclusive access to your share links only for your subdomain and no one else's. So that is a huge upgrade for us. Cool. It helps you protect your IP. Totally. Uh, white label mobile app. We did a bunch of cool stuff here. You can check out inbound calling. You can do inbound calling natively now in the app. That means when I call in, it's a voice over IP uh, connection and a voice over IP conversation. So now we're literally not forwarding out anymore. We're answering it in the mobile app. This is also coming to desktop later this quarter. So we're really wow, going towards nice. the full phone system, one-stop shop. So that's Very really cool. Uh, Conversation 2.0, cool designs, blocking the calendar. All that's wonderful. Bunch of stuff come in, yada, yada. That's awesome. White label mobile app. This is for your white label mobile app for your agency. Um, putting it out to all your sub accounts. We are working hard on custom customization. So you can do colors, fonts, you can do reordering of menu items, adding of menu items if you want to add your own, custom splash screen stuff. You, and it's all customizable within the within high level. You can see here, here's like kind of all the different things you can customize. Yeah, um, you can see like when you order it, we have this really cool little tracker that shows you like where you're at in the process. You can manage your profiles. Your, and then you can also have your share links here. Make it super easy to actually just dis distribution out to your customers when you get it. SMS campaign, here you go, everybody, come and get it. So that's amazing, all, on and on and on. In fact, we'll even do the invite for you right here on screen. All that's coming this quarter. Um, as you can see here, we've got kind of like an early preview for the first 50 people who check it out. So there's that. Um, WordPress, WordPress is now live. This is awesome. So um, I, I of course would, you know, I would love to say, well, why was, why wouldn't everybody use our website builder? But I get it. We all have clients who have WordPress, or you just come across a new client, and you know, they're like, I want to do SEO, and you're it, like, the first thing, the last thing they want to hear is, okay, let's rebuild your website. Now you can say, and this is a, such an easy sale. You say, listen, I saw that you have WordPress. You know what I want to do? I'm going to go ahead and get your site to rank higher. And here's how it works. I'm going to take your WordPress website. I'm going to move it over to my hosting. We use Google's level one CDN, which is faster than any CDN on the planet earth. And it's going to automatically make it faster. And oh, by the way, it's in Google's network. So maybe they also notice that as well. But either way, you're going to rank higher. Um, how about them apples? And I think most people would say that's amazing. We make it super easy to move over. You can put your domain in, one-click migration, pre-configured email, plugin management, theme management, user management, antivirus, backup and restore all in, in app now ready to rock. Um, so you can really move all of those customers over, make an easy, quick sale, and then add more as you go along. So there's WordPress. Nice. Very cool. Um, FTP access coming soon uh, this quarter for those of you who need to do bulk uh, migrations. So that's that. Reputation management stuff. Go check it out. It's reviews. It's pretty simple. Yeah, same thing. Go check it out. But scan tool. Let's talk about this. This is the beginning of something beautiful. So this is a sales tool that we're developing that's going to expand in scope over the next couple of quarters, but it's going to start like this. You put in the business information, we pop out a little report here, and now you're going after the client and you can sell anything you want. You don't need to sell Yex, you could sell SEO, you could sell SaaS, you could sell whatever, but this is a really great sales tool for you to start showing them where they could be do, doing better with their business. You'll be able to email it out to them, all that wonderful stuff. So that is going live this quarter. That's going live this this quarter. Correct. That, okay. that actually is really, really cool for our SaaS entrepreneurs out, out there as well. I think we're going to have to be building out some more training on how to use this and how to use this as a tool 
um, for people because this is going to help. This exactly. is going to be another foot in the door, another way to speak to people, another way to close people, and to and to bring them into in, into the system. And even if you're not an agency that runs Facebook ads or Google ads or anything like that, there's a local SEO perspective that we can very quickly simply show you how to bolt on to to do to run this and bring them in. So this on its own also has the potential to be super powerful. I totally agree. Should we pause for questions or keep on rolling? Uh, yeah, but, um, maybe maybe <clears throat> we should we should pause the questions. But I, I I know that a few people are wondering, and I know that Robin jumped up on uh, on screen because said you know there were there were all all of this stuff. Mm -hmm. here. This is like you're doubling almost the features that that you guys have got. What is the new price plan? What is it going to cost people to get <laughs> yeah, all right. this stuff? Nothing, right? So there is no new price plan. Um, we're not raising prices. You know, we we are just trying to pack more value into what we're already doing, right? Um, incredible. And, and this is really what's important to us. Our, our, you know, our mission is if we can deliver more value to you, we're going to do just fine. So that's what we're doing here. So all of these things are flooding into the existing plans. I would say uh, everything I've shown so far is 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 on. I think all of the plans actually. Um, and so you can get them uh, right right now. And you know, our goal is you know we don't want to raise our prices. We want to keep our prices how they are. Um, we're going to actually talk. So in payments, which we'll talk about in a second, we're going to be the big news there is just we're adding third party payments through like an authorized.net. Um, we won't be charging any fees on that. We won't be charging any percentages on that. There's nothing funny going on. It's literally just, hey, I don't want to use Stripe. I want to use something else. Great. You can use it. So that's the idea there. Super simple. Just bring it in, bring in those folks. That'll be done at the end of this quarter as well. Um, wow. For those of you who are not. You have a couple of questions. I'm oh so yeah, sorry. sorry. No, I'll, well, I'll just I'll drop this <laughs> and I'll shut up and answer a question. WhatsApp. So for all of you who are not in the United States or who use WhatsApp in the United States, but I'd say mostly outside of the U.S., WhatsApp is coming. It's coming at the end of this quarter. And here's the fun news about this: we actually had this ready to rock and uh, through Twilio, and then we found out that uh, Facebook came out with its own direct integration, which that's what we're using here, and that's cool and all. But the secret is you can't just integrate and turn it on. You have to get special permission from Meta. And we had actually a Meta employee at our event, which was cool. So we have some, gotten enough attention from those good folks that they're going to kind of give us the, the pass-through on the back end. So super excited nice. about this. Nice. And that's going to be watch. way better. And does that mean it's going to be cheaper as well? It is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So all, Twilio had some, Twilio had override fees on this. Those all go away. Um, these are the, there's like a standard fee list. If you Google it, like Facebook, WhatsApp pricing or something, they charge some amount for that. We all will just basically, um, pass that through to you. And then if you want to, you can actually, mark, you'll be able to mark that up as well. It's just another way for you to make more money. Whoa. Amazing. Awesome. So let's hit a couple of these questions. If we could. Away, I know we, don't, we, got. we have less than 15 minutes with Sean. So we're going to go fast. Um, Anne is asking, how do you move phone numbers from Twilio to high level? I mean, click I think the button, that's a really click the button. We walk you through it. Moving on. <laughs> yeah, super, super quick, super easy, super fast. Yeah, yeah. Big, it, it big, is really easy. Button. Oh, actually, in fact, it's gotten better since you did it, Alistair. If, uh, if you did it a while ago, you used mm -hmm. to have to do a one off. There's now a bulk process and you can do yeah. them all at the same time. Boom. Awesome. Uh, Foz is asking, we'd love to understand incoming calls better. No more need to forward calls. Correct. That is the, that is the gist right there. No more need to forward the calls. Okay. What about QuickBooks Online? Uh, well, that's part of the payments team. I mean, we obviously have an integration with QuickBooks already. Oh, as far as payments go, um, yeah, we'll probably add those. Um, you know, it's tough. <laughs> Everyone and their brother, it, this is the thing I always hear. It's like, what about Square? What about QuickBooks? What about upside down pay, inside out pay, blue pay, yellow pay, green pay? It's like, for God's <laughs> sakes, right? Um, but guess what? They're all the same. They're payments. But um, we will integrate with the major ones. So if I had to play this out to, let's say, Q2 of next year, I bet you Square makes the makes the cut. QuickBooks makes the cut and authorize it. And that makes the cut. And then I'm stopping right there because if it doesn't break down the door for us, as far as getting more clients in, and I mean this for SaaSpreneurs, if you're not able to walk in and pull a customer out because of that payment integration, like I don't care, we're not doing it. I'm telling you, they're all the same, all, all, all. And anybody who tells you otherwise is lying because one way or another, it's just running a credit card and and the, the fees are what the fees are. And they're either yeah. going to you, going to me, going to the both of us, you know, whatever. But that's just the gist. It's super boring. So we just want to want to crazy on something yeah. that, quite frankly, adds very little value. But we will, we will absolutely bring in third party payments because we respect the fact that what where this gets the pushback is, hey, I already have Wells Fargo payments. Now you can say no problem. We support Wells Fargo payments because Authorized.net does that. 
Yeah, and guys, trust, trust Sean on that because he's got a big background in this area as well. So he knows what he's talking about there on top of all of his high level stuff. My, yeah, my, okay, my, Sean's going to spend more minutes going. with us. Yeah, yeah, let me just get a keep closing. Yeah, no, one more. Um, uh, uh, Faz how is asking, do how, how, how do we do rebuilding if we're not on the SAS plan? And Faz, I'll, I'll, I'll answer this. You've got to be on the SAS plan. And if you go to the profitpack.com and click the button there, you can upgrade with us and you can do your rebuilding. So go use our upgrade link because then you'll get all of our free stuff. And I'm telling you, we give more than anybody else out there. It's the most comprehensive SAS training on the planet. Go to the profitpack.com upgrade. I think there, that's really, really, really be smart because that. just do the upgrade and that's great and all, but you don't get all the techniques. You don't get all the strategy. Like you got, you should definitely use their link because it's going to, you're going to get way more than what we give you. So definitely might as well get all the benefits. So I just highly recommend that. Um, blogging. Uh, we do, last, oh, oh, go ahead, Amy. You got another question for me? Go, go. Say, the last, the last question is what about WeChat? Are you going to integrate with WeChat? WeChat, maybe ideas list for the win on that one. I mean, I've heard of it, okay. but I, you know, I feel like, <clears throat> I mean, there's no reason why, okay, to, to be fair, there's no reason why we wouldn't integrate with every channel eventually, right? It's just, again, anything that's not squarely, the, okay, so first of all, how did everything get here that's here? It's simple. It went on the ideas list. It got voted up. That's why we know WhatsApp is super important. If WeChat makes the makes the list, and again, actually, this is a great time to do it, ideas.gohighlevel.com. For those of you who are customers, come here. Here's every single part of the app, um, and then some in case we missed it. And then feel free to come in and be like, oh, hey, on the, on the CRM, I really want to see X. My big piece of advice is you might want to look to see what X is and see if it's already here because there's a lot of like-minded, smart people. And go in here and actually vote it up. Notice the things I'm talking about here. Yeah, um, I, I didn't mention it, but scheduled responses, it's on the list for this quarter. Two-way email saying, whoa, on the list for this quarter. Amazing. How does this work? You can see right here, we don't make this stuff up. We get it from you and we get it off this ideas list. It's just that simple. So anyways, go All right, here. So we're going to let uh, Sean talk for the next nine minutes. And then I no, just no, want to no, make sure okay. you guys, uh, you guys give me five, give me no. five and I'll let you answer. You can take nine or whatever. No. No, we can, we, we can talk about what we're going to give our bonus that we're going to give after you. Um, awesome. You all right. Gone. So that's, so we've got blogging. All. that's just, that, yep. That's cool. We've got blogging. It's good. The big thing I'm just going to shout, shout out here is RSS emails and category pages. That's up here, here shortly. So that's useful. Social planner, we have full social media posting. The big thing there is uh, TikTok is coming uh, up in like a week or two. Um, the stats are all here, which is cool. Just showing people are posting like crazy. Oh, sorry, CSV imports. This is amazing. So this is the ability to take a CSV file, which is essentially an Excel file, pre-populate it with a bunch of posts and then upload it en masse um, to a bunch of accounts. And so this would be like, I got a plumber pack. I got a lawyer pack. I got a doctor pack. Boom, boom, boom. You can send this out to people. They can upload it or you can upload it. And it not only does it put the social media content in there, which is awesome, but it pre-schedules all of it. So it goes out when you want it to go out. So here you go. That's amazing, right? Um, here's the roadmap, TikTok posting, Instagram stories and reels, all that. Check it out. Email marketing. Let me see here. This is all the stuff that we did. Uh, oh, A-B testing. This is on lock. So down here, you can see this. Um, subject testing, then body testing, um, going out. The idea here is really simple. It sends out um, multivariate testing, even these dis distributions, looks to see what the open rates are. And then body, it's like you can do opens and clicks. And then based on that, you know who's winning you know, and, and then you know which email to send and boom, you're good to go. So email A-B testing, super cool feature on the email builder coming out this quarter. Wow, wow. That is That has the potential to be really, really awesome actually in all the, all the split testing you can do with that. Absolutely. Now. You want to see how I'd roll it as a SaaSpreneur? This is my favorite release of the whole thing, templates. This is the, the simplest idea that with the most profound impact. So literally, this is the idea that in, in websites and funnels and social media posts um, and in email campaigns, and we'll add workflows, we'll add a bunch of other things. But for now, those four categories, you're coming in, you hit new new website, new social media posts, and you've got these tons of these templates. In fact, this thing just does not do it justice. We got to go look at this over here since we're here. Um, let's go to marketing. This is insane. And it looks like you must have like a thousand templates or so in there now. Yeah, yeah, we do. In fact, um, and it's only going to get better from here. Um, we're continually investing a ton of money 
in having these all um, created for us and, uh, by all kinds of designers and things. But you can see here, here's a bunch of yoga posts. I'm sorry for the slow loading because I'm in the darn car. What can you do? But here you go. You're uh, uh, This is what I would do. I would walk into a business and be like, hey, do you post on social media three times a week? No, you don't. Okay, great. Should you post on social media three times a week? Yes, you should. Absolutely. How about I automate that whole thing for you for 300 bucks a month? Boom, there you go. Moving on. And you have the posts ready to go, pre, pre-canned for you. And you don't even have to think it, think it up. You don't have to figure it out. It's all just right here. And you can schedule it up. Um, figure out when you want it to go out and go. Simple. So wow. I love that. Wow. Um, payments and invoicing, cool stats here. Um, we're just driving hard. The goal, the goal long term with payments and invoicing is simple. We're gonna estimates are coming, proposals are coming. Our goal, our mission here is to have a full invoicing system for anybody who wants it. Um, and really for the goal is to have uh have this ready to rock for small businesses. We introduced coupons, by the way. Coupons are live. They work on funnels. Coupons were huge or a big ask. Um, so those are now there. Um, you can see, okay, so third-party payments I mentioned. On Stripe, we're going to be launching Apple Pay, Google Pay, Affirm, Klarna, ACH, Direct Debit. Those all go out this quarter. Um, so that's done. Affiliate management system. Um, this is really huge, I think, for two reasons. One, it's full affiliate management software. So this is like a first promoter kind of thing. Um, not as advanced as first promoter, but not too far off either. Um, and for any of you working with local business, this is actually uh, a referral management product. You can actually use this to create referrals for small business. So that is, hey, want to get more customers without spending any money on ads? Great. Here you go. Bake up an offer. Think Groupon. To, you know, for $100, get $200 worth of service. You send a, a unique link out to all their existing customers. They share it with their friends. If their friends buy... You cut the you cut the person who did the referral in. Hey, you get fifty bucks. The business gets fifty bucks, and bam, the business gets a bunch of new customers walking through the door. It's awesome. Wow, wow, that's insane. And I I, I saw a beta sort of draft of, of this, uh, and I forget the, the the dev's name who was running it all, but she was really great in talking about where it was all going forward, and 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 just like all of your stuff, really wanted to speak to people that were using it or going to use it to yep. really take it in the in the right direction. It's, it's going to be amazing. So all the reporting stuff's amazing. Agency role reporting, Eliza, you can yeah, that's all good. Um, all good, all good. Resource center, advertising bundles. That's it. Good, I did it. Woo, I'm out. Wow. <laughs> that's all a, right. That, that's, that's that's absolutely insane. There's so much value, and it's not custody right extra. Now I started off um talking about I've had a bunch of people reach out to me and say, "Hey, level up's coming. Do I need to wait and hold off?" Or, "Hey, they just re released this. Do I need to wait for more more training?" Is there anything in here that says, "Hey, I shouldn't just get out there and sell," or that needs to change how people are doing business? You're, you're nuts to not have already done this, right? Um, at the end of the day, um, you know that we need to uh. You could be doing this. You could have been doing this forever ago. I mean, we have more than enough features to sell SaaS all day long to any business forever for the rest of um, the, the century, let alone anything else that we're going to release. Remember, the biggest mistake you can make with high level is is waiting for us to do yet another feature because you don't need yet another feature. We do these features mostly. Hate to break it to you, we we do them to get attention for people who aren't are don't already know who we are. We call it, you know, sell them what they want, give them what they need. So we just make something that we think is actually sort of useless or not very useful compared to what we already have, just so that we can get their attention to bring them in and say like, oh yeah, we have that thing, but now let's show you the more important stuff that you never even thought of, right? So all the important stuff, let me tell you, we started with that a long time ago. It's already there. Miss called a text back, following up with leads that their your customers don't follow up with. Like your customers don't even have a lead problem, by the way, they have a nurture problem. They all have leads coming in every single day that they- That was, that was where you up. started, right? You didn't even have all it's the It's still the best feature. So, yeah. It's still the most needed feature. I am telling you, every business that puts a sign on the door has somebody walk through it and then they don't follow up. This is this is how this is how we found you when that was pretty much all, all you had. And Amy, Amy and I yeah, came across absolutely. you guys. Like, it's amazing. Absolutely. It's still our best feature by a long shot because that's the problem, right? Most businesses will say, oh, I want more leads. Like, actually, hold on, let's go look at all the leads you've got in the last six months. How many of these did you not follow up with 10 times? How many of these did you not get back to in the first five minutes? How many phone calls do you miss every single day from your Google My Business account? Tons, you fools. Like, give me a break. All you got to do is follow up with those people and turn them into gold. So there's all of that opportunity still on the table. And as a SaaS you can go in and you can do missed call text back, GMB chat, web chat, 
Um, those those three features, you know, it, you, and you can get fancy, you can start doing text to pay and all this, but you do those little simple things and boom, you can create just money out of thin air for almost any small business. Simple. And oh, by the way, it's all automated. You're using a computer to do it. So, you know, this isn't bespoke agency work. This isn't grinding yourself down every single day, 10 hours a day, trying to make one client happy with some custom website that they want a thousand changes with. This is a, a system that you can stamp out to, to, to the cows come home and make a great deal of money. And then when you want to go on vacation, guess what? You can go because the system is running all of the all of the output for you and creating all of the value. So they don't need you to be there to do yet another website change. You're, you, you can just go on vacation. Imagine that. Exactly, exactly. exactly. Is, One more question um, from Anna. Can we watermark clients' logos on social media posts? Uh, I mean, I, I guess, can't you just watermark their, I guess we, we don't dynamically watermark them. I guess you could watermark yeah. them yourself. Um, but then yeah. couldn't I just go to the website and steal it direct? Like, I don't get it. Yeah. Some I guess I guess some clients like that, but that's the client's yeah. logo with or without the watermark on the website. I mean, I mean, unless they're watermarking on their website. But at the end of the day, I mean, if you're talking about the actual posts and stuff, I don't know. Like I could just hack off the logo or pull the logo out. I mean, there's a lot of photo stuff these days that I feel like if you want to steal a social media post or something, I mean it's kind of easy to do with or without the logo. I could be missing it though. I'm not a I'm not an ace marketer, but um, no, we don't, we don't auto watermark, but again, you put it on the ideas list. This is a great thing. It's not about me and my, my preconceived notions. It's about you and your votes. We roll the way our customers ask us to roll. It's super important us to follow what our customers ask us to do. So you want watermarking? We'll give it to you. Well, it um, doesn't look like we have any more questions. From oh, I, everybody I do though. I do. I got, oh, I got, okay. I got, I got a couple of quick ones though. Um, just to, just to add on. So we talked about you know, the, the stuff that high level brought to the event and it was your event. And, but you had a number of really key speakers, some of which are known from outside of high level and some of which have been using high level for a long time and bought some yep. really amazing content there. Are there, are there. Were there any big takeaways that you saw? I mean, I know there was so much content there and I'm, uh, and I'm oh, sort of putting yeah, it in a spot, absolutely. but were there any key, any key takeaways that you were like, that you yourself were like, oh, wow, that's really cool. Or in, oh yeah, there, absolutely. That, are that you kidding can... me? I mean, well, so first of all, to be fair, that's a terrible question for me because I barely okay. saw any of the sessions at all because I was running the whole time. But I will tell you every time, like I took like Julie Chanel, I took notes. She was talking about, she does SaaS in a big way. And she was like, oh, well, we always hook up their domains first. And I'm like, we don't do that. So I was like taking a note and I sent it to, to, to Austin on my team. Like we should get domains hooked up, right? Like, so I took, I took tons of notes on that. Or like, look at somebody like Frank Hurd, who I think would say to you, I'm not a tech ninja. I've been around since, you know, the time of fire, right? Like I'm just an old school marketer dude, but look, I'm doing hundreds of thousands of dollars in monthly SaaS recurring revenue, right? I mean, he would say like, he's not, he's not like special. That's what I like. I talked to him. He seems like such a down to earth dude. And yet he's super successful in SaaS, right? Which is a very new school thing. So I just learned that there are so many different ways that this can be done. So many different people I met, I met, you know what I loved? The favorite part of this about the event. I love the speakers. They're great, but I like the community more. I like that so many people who aren't big names would come up to me and be like, Hey, you know, um, two years ago, I had this really terrible agency. I had five clients. I was killing myself to make the rent. And I'm actually a $10 million business now because of SAS. And I'm like, that's the stories I love. That's what really got me excited or watching people connect, right? Like watching people, it was a small enough event that it was intimate. So people could talk to each other and meet each other and learn from each other. So those things, those were the greatest parts of that event for me. Very cool. And what's the secret for, for somebody who has is thinking of diving into, into SaaS or has recently dived into SaaS, but of course, you know, they, they, they're conscious, even if they've gone through our link and they've got a 30 day extended. Yep. Trial. What's the what's the do you have any quick? Oh yeah, I mean, what's I, the I mean, secret to, to get yeah, them started? Yeah, yeah. Getting started. I, I know what I would do. I mean, I know I know exactly what I'd do. Yeah. I would pick I would pick one feature I, um, that I thought I could sell the heck out of that I really understood, like miscall call text back or reputation management. Um, like like I did actually the one the one client we have in Eugene, um, the HVAC Alpine that they're great. I would walk out my front door, <laughs> and I would go sell to every small business locally to me. I use a home court advantage to my to, to my favor. And I would realize that, listen, first of all, they're in most people's local areas. There's more than enough business for them to be rich for the end of their days. But 
if for whatever reason, someday you dominate your local area, you can still go national and keep your business. There's no limiting factor there. You might as well start with something that's easy and scale up from there. But ultimately the local agencies have easy trust. They're able to knock on doors easier. People like them more. In fact, good, interesting story. There's a guy, a town up from me who is, he? when I first met him, he's like an agency. I'm starting off with, I'm going to go national. I'm going to go after pastors because I'm a pastor and all this stuff. I'm like, that's cool. That's great. Here later, how's it going? Oh, I'm really struggling, all this stuff. He becomes a franchisee of uh, another agency. And I talked to him at the event and I'm like, how are things going? He's like, oh, I'm crushing it. Oh, things are so amazing. So great. I'm like, oh, cool. Well, what changed? He's like, oh, I'm going to the Chamber of Commerce now. I'm getting all my leads from the Chamber of Commerce in my town, in my town. That's it. That's what he changed, you know? And I'm like, uh, duh, go local, man. Like, of course, start local. It works. Get your feet wet, get experience. This is why I would tell everybody. In fact, I, I'm just telling you, I, I think it's the easiest way to roll. Um, it's a great way to scale a business and it's a good way to make a lot of money. So I say go local. That's me. And 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 and, and the good thing there is that, that when you know the business owners know other business owners, you're having success with them, then they're gonna mention it to, to other oh, business owners as well. Wait a second. I think there's someone we could use to incentivize business owners to tell other business owners about us. Oh, have you, have really you man, recently believed something? Or something? Heck yeah, man. You can light the town on fire in five minutes like this. You're like, hey, next time you go talk to your buddy at the bar, the B&I meeting or the whatever, Here's a, give him a link. I've got a special deal. Oh, and by the way, if he signs up, I'll kick you some money every month. Imagine that. Yeah, this is actually, we're going to, as as the affiliate software builds up, we're going to have to put some more more training on that because that's got huge potential. I, I think we find that some of the people we find that are struggling are just not getting in front of people. And you've just got to go and get in front of yeah, people. How, get out however the that door. Is. You guys, yeah. you guys. Here's the deal. Everything that Sean just said is all in our profit pack training from my sales training. Yeah, Every freaking God darn thing that he just went over is exactly what's already in there. So if you're not part of it, you need to be. I'm and telling. something that you something that you were just talking about the whole referral thing. Um, Alistair and I actually just figured out something. Instead of giving them money, yeah, what we are doing is we are yeah, crediting cool. their text and their email credits. There you go, right? Giving I love them that. that as the bonus I love that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Money. Yeah, and 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 cool let, 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 let's just explain that to everybody. We are doing we're doing a free X markup on on our rebilling. Now we just gave somebody a hundred bucks, right? We gave them a hundred bucks credited on their account. Here's what that means. So that actually costs us thirty three dollars, and that's but only they get. They use it all. Uh, only if they use it, it costs us thirty-three dollars. So it might cost us less. Uh, um, but they see a hundred bucks. Wow, that's awesome! I just got a hundred bucks, but we're giving them actually and thirty-three if, bucks if, or if less. They use it. If they use it, they're going to use it to do something to make them money. So they're going to get a free credit that they're going to turn into revenue, and they're going to associate that beautiful, wonderful experience with you. Exactly, exactly. So this is really, really cool. It has huge, huge potential. Um, we're going to be bringing more stuff out there. But Amy's exactly right. I mean, it's funny. I'm smiling. I was talking to Sean because all of the stuff, Amy's got the train. She goes into more detail. She walks you through it. She takes you how to do it. It's super, super cool. Go to theprofitpact.com to go sign up. Um, I know Sean has to get going in a second. Yep, we have I, a big I just put on my seatbelt. I'm going. Oh, there we go. People, pe people are asking about our announcement. So we, we, we all right. You guys we'll, we'll go drop your that. announcement. Thank you for having me. It was awesome to be here, and I will talk to you folks soon. Bye Perfect. for now. Thank, Thank you, Sean. You. Bye. Uh, um, so, but that stuff is it's in the train and more and more. There's there's more stuff than that because we don't just have one sales course. We have two sales courses in there, and this leads us naturally onto our announcement because some of you were just talking about getting in front of, of customers. However, you do it well. Um, a lot of these people that you need to get in front of are cold people. They're, they're cold. They're people that you don't know. So we have cold outreach training. You've asked for it. We've got it. Cold outreach training. It's yours. And just like Sean and their price plan of adding more stuff to it, we are going to charge you absolutely nothing for it. You get it for free. Cold outreach training. Once we hop off this, I am going to drop it. Anyone who has gone through our Profit Pact um, training and they have got they have gone through our affiliate link, I am going to go and drop that um in your account give me like i don't know tw 20 minutes i haven't i've got i've got the product i haven't put it in the in the offer i've got to go add it to the offer it won't take me long give me about 20 minutes when we get off here and then just refresh your membership dashboard so that's where your other courses are all the other courses there cold outreach training will be in there there is a snapshot within that snapshot there isn't just one form of cold outreach but there are two forms of cold outreach 
You can go through there. It's got all the training. It's got the snapshots. It will take you through it. We are giving it to you for free. I mean, the reason we're calling it cold, cold outreach, that's what it's going to look like. So go look at your dashboard. Amy's sharing. That's what it, it's going to look like. Um, and it's cold outreach because it isn't cold email. There's an email in there, but there are other, uh, other, other techniques in there that we go through. That's all in there. If you want it, go to theprofitpack.com, sign up, um, up, upgrade or grab high level through our affiliate link and automatically that's just going to get added to your membership dashboard with us it's there if you're new to signing up with us sometimes these sign up emails either go to promotions or go to spam so go look there and um and find them and do us a favor drag them into your your, your main inbox um so that that kind of um stops happening just, um yeah hold on hold on i just want to quickly clarify what alistair just said um, for those of you that have been with us, with me, with the sales training, with Zoom rooms, with DVRs, with everything these past couple of years, and for those of you that are brand new to our affiliate, have signed up under us, and we've helped you grow your, your SaaS plant, your, your, your clients, things like that. You always ask me, <laughs> everybody wants the easiest point of attaining something, right? What is going to be the least friction that's going to give me opportunities? Um, a lot of you are afraid to cold call. A lot of you are afraid to go face to face with um, in local businesses. A lot of you are like, I need Facebook ads. I need, I need leads to come to me, right? So you're like every other client that we sign up, right? And I have told you, and I've, I've, I've held you off for a couple of months because we needed to build it out for you. Um, as of probably 12 to 18 months ago, we created cold outreach ourselves, and we have really fine tuned this with uploading and find, how do you find the, con first of all, how you find the contacts to, to get in there that is coming, but how do you get people who are cold to you to reach out to you to then be able to have that conversation? What do you do? It's literally, this is the cold outreach sales method that we are now giving to you. For those of you that are our affiliates, um, you are going to get it. It's going to show up right in your training within the next 30 minutes. Uh, so you, you're going to have it. You're going to have everything of how to set it up. You're going to see the two different methodologies that we use from everything that we started with. We're only giving you what works. So there's two different methodologies that we use. In addition, you have me talking about when those calls start coming in and they're going to come in and they're going to come in fast and furious. You need to be ready for it. So for those of you that are brand new to the whole set idea of SaaS and high level, I'm just going to give you, and I say this in the training as well. You need to have talked to some relatives that are business owners, some local people that are business owners before you try this. Because when you do this cold outreach method, you're going to have people ringing your phone and you need to be ready and know how you're going to position whatever you're looking to position. And I go through it in the sales training. I give you the key aspects that we literally position. It's literally one feature of high level. There's, I mean, there's different opportunities, but we only position one feature to start off with to attract them, to get them to want to have the call with us. Okay. So we go through that in the training. I just wanted to share that with you. It's finally here, you guys. You guys can have it run rampant, run, run wild. Uh, be ready for these calls because they come in. And it's it's super cool. So if you are signed up through the profit pact uh, and or upgraded through our affiliate link um then you're just going to get it um on there so if you've got a few courses in there then we're just going to add to it um there are one or two of you that are some sort of special case or whatever just reach out directly to me we'll take care of you so those of you that are special cases who have been with us for a, a long time that you should be getting it um or you know anything like that or if you're not sure just reach out to me but we're going to take care of people so don't worry uh we'll take care of you um couple of couple of questions as well that came in jock asked a couple of times how do you um how do you uh upload a video no your question was how do you record a video to upload um quite simple anything anything you want go and use your phone your phone phone cameras are awesome these days use a dslr use it use your computer if you're screen sharing i tell you what i recorded a lot of the profit packed on 
I used Loom and I I I did the I upgraded the settings on Loom to call it higher quality. I used Loom. I then downloaded that and then I and then then we uploaded. There are various ways you can do it. I think your question is also about the formats. I'm not sure. Certainly MP4 probably dot dot MOV. It will, it will be the main formats, just like you can upload to YouTube or, or whatever. If it's a format that nobody's heard of, it's probably not going to work. It's going to be you know it's going to be two or three formats. Go go and go go and record one. See if it will upload and you'll quickly find out. I'm sure they have a help doc somewhere with that but it's going to be the standard thing and if it's if it's if it's in something that nobody uses so you know they're not going to accept that um i saw another uh question Anna's asking with all this new stuff what is a new good feature we can sell the heck out of thinking video video sales levels prefers i'll tell you one um it's the memberships and you look at their membership stats and if you uh, anyone who went to the level up event or have watched a replay of some of their announcements. One of the things that I think it was Varun, who's like one of the three co-founders um, said was the key thing here is they've sort of, they launched memberships and like a little bit of stuff happened, but not very much. And then like one year later after they launched it, the, it suddenly took off and it's going places. And I'll tell you memberships, think of, of, of all the course creators, all the coaches, the consultants, all those people out there now, if you haven't got it, go to theprofitpack.com, sign up, go and get uh, our training and then open it on your phone. And it's going to prompt you to put that as an app onto your phone and go do it because one, I want you to do it. But two, go and see how easy it is for them for no cost. They don't have to go and hire a developer to do special coding, to have an app, to pay the app stores, to have licensing there, to do all that, to have an app of their content on somebody's phone. Just like that, go see how easy it is to get an app of their own content with their own logo, with their own name, whatever it is on somebody's phone like that. It's so easy. There's no extra charge. It costs you nothing extra to do, but you can create this for them. So think about uh, you, you know anyone that might need or could use a course and go sell them that. It's absolutely amazing feature. Um, you know, definitely, definitely look at, at that. Um, Jock saying B and I could work as well as Chamber of Commerce. Yes, and I know Keith does a bunch of that sort of thing as well. And I know there's a few of you guys, so um, so that's great. Uh, what else? Jock saying I have screencast matic so I could do that. Perfect. There you go. Uh, um, so so you've got that. You've got all 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 kinds of ways, things, methods to use all all of that. Um, uh, Anna, what do we sell the course and app for? Uh, the membership courses for us is in our third tier package which is at 497 level the whole app piece literally it just came out last week it like this is brand new um so we haven't thought through the next stage of of, of doing that but you know i just think if it's going to be a you know they do it themselves kind of thing if you want to handhold them and walk them through it and say you could put you know you could probably charge them a setup fee if they want the app you know sort of thing or something you'll go and set that up with the different color schemes and you just tick a box on the options you can pick you know you, you can send them a little screenshot and say here are our 12 different color schemes you can have for mobile which one would you like and they say that one and then you go and tick that box and do it for them you know or something uh something like that you could you you could you you could sort of do um, all that so you could probably charge a setup fee that goes with it uh and uh, and stuff but i don't know i think 497 is still um you know it's not it's not a bad price but you start pushing up i think selling it is going to get harder um but uh but yeah so so there we go um that's awesome i just anyway, want so much potential yeah i want i just want to mention something i've had some conversations with clients and with actual other platforms that high level truly competes with i've had some conversations in the last couple of weeks with them um specifically constant contact and uh salesforce i just want to give you a heads up high level is such a key component to what is spurring business out there from a platform perspective salesforce now is pushing the hell out of texting Salesforce is mostly used for big manufacturers, big enterprise companies, some smaller guys use it to pay a hell of a lot of money for each seat and each license and they're pushing text. Now think about this, 
how many years ago, Alistair, did we sign up with High Level and they added the text feature? Years ago. So these other platforms are trying to keep up with High Level. They're not. High Level is the top. They are crushing it. Um, we had a client that you use, uh, utilizes uh, constant contact prior to us coming on board. And they're a very high paying client of ours. Um, that she goes, uh, hey, can you guys help me out, figure out a, a <laughs> privacy policy in terms of service? I'm signing up for texting through constant contact. And I went, why would you do that when we have it in the system? Sometimes you have to remind clients of what they have. Now, this is the, the stumbling block a little bit with having so many features on such a phenomenal platform. But this is where you sort of have to stay up on things of what high level all offers. So as Sean was talking, Alistair, and I don't know if there's something in high level that's already the, uh, doing this, but maybe we should develop an actual list of every single feature of high level. And from a sales perspective, when a company says this word, this is the feature you should offer type of thing. So um, I don't, I don't think they have that. I don't think it's, they have a list of every it's, single feature. It's going to be, it's going to be a long, 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 long list. It is. But, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. It is, so, but I mean, from a sales there's, there's, there's so much, it's so cool. Especially for the folks that are new, it can be very overwhelming. But hint, hint, I've broken it down for you in the sales training, especially on this cold email outreach, what particular features work like so, so, so well to get your foot in the door and have that sales conversation. So um, I know we're over time. I thank you all for, for sticking out with us. I really thank Sean for coming on board. One of the first people, uh, groups that he has spoken regarding all these new updates and features after their, their in-person event. Um, very excited about all this new stuff. Um, lean on us, you guys. We are here. When you're successful, we're successful. That's why we're giving everything away for this SaaS opportunity to help you grow your business along with ours. Yeah, it's super, super cool. Couple, couple of quick questions. Faz is saying the um, the the cold outreach bonus is only for existing affiliates. Yes, um, but if you need to upgrade, you could upgrade for us and go get it. So again, go to theprofitpack.com. It's going to give you um, a link, sign up for our course. It's going to give you all the links or reach out to me or Amy if you're struggling struggling with all of that. Um, you can you can go uh, find all that. And so you you can go upgrade for us too and go and find all of, all of that stuff and um, you can get access to it. So don't worry about that. We will take care of you. Um, active, <laughs> Anna's saying active campaign is losing a ton of businesses uh, uh, as well. Uh, so a ton of business. Uh, yeah, I mean, it, yeah. it must kind of suck to be in some of these other companies that just haven't innovated um, in in all of that same way as well. Yeah. You know, like, uh, I don't know, but it's like anything, you you know, if you don't innovate, you're going to be taken over and you're going to, you're going to lose. So. Yeah. You, you have a gift horse gonna... looking you in the looking you in the face, and that is high level. Then you have our training on top of it, and us to lean on if and when you have questions. I mean, how many of you have reached out to either myself or Alistair and gotten the answers that you needed personally? This is where we are trying to go over and above, because you know what? With how many years we've lived, you know what makes us feel the best is to watch other people succeed, um, because it just it just I don't know. When we succeed, we want you to succeed. So why not help? Okay. Yeah, yeah, very cool. Um, so, um, Keith, you're asking for um, the te the template library. I think it's all in the same place. Actually, I'm not sure whether it is for the social media posts. Um, I, if you go to funnels, you go to websites, you can you can grab the template library there. Uh, you might have to. I'm just in an account right now, but it's not. It's a test account. It's not connected to anything. I think you've got to have it connected, and then you'll be able to bring pull up the template library there for the social media templates. Um, but if not, let me know. We'll take care of you. Um, everyone else, go sign up, theprofitpack.com. We'll take care of you all there, uh, just like we always have been. Thank you very, very, very much indeed. Um, thank you to Sean, who I know has gone now, but it's amazing. And they continue to give us amazing value. You know, we, you could sell a product of half of, now a quarter of what a high level is, but they keep adding this value. They keep adding more features that, that are asked for that we don't necessarily need. 
um, but it but it's it's really really awesome and the price is not going up um, so jump on in there is no better time than right now cool. to go and start your own SaaS business and uh, Amy's got a final point I just have a final point so we've been signing on a shit ton of SaaS clients lately um, and it's pretty fun we've been building just really fun we had one client come on board uh, and he said um, just so you know you're one of three marketing companies um, and, and platform companies uh, to help me with my leads, lead generation and follow up and things like that. And um, I'm going to be working with all three of you for 30 days. And at the end of the 30 days, I'm going to um, narrow it down. It's only I'm going to stick with only one. Within the first two weeks of us working with this guy, he already told us, I've already fired one. I'm firing one at the end of in the next two weeks. You guys are the one I'm sticking with. I can see everything on my dashboard. I love what you put together for me on my platform. I can see all, and by the way, we're running all his ads on our ad account, not his. So he can't go running and start using our stuff. It's all ours, but they can see the all of the ad reporting right on his dashboard through the reports. That's what he wanted to see, you know, yeah. what was going on, how much he's spending. And he is so excited that we are, not only he said, I love your platform. I'm sticking with you. I, you guys are know what you're doing. Da, 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 da. So I'm telling you, you have a gift horse. If you have gone, if you are going after this, it is, you will beat out the competition as long as you understand what the client issue is and how to fix it utilizing high level. Yeah, super cool. Super amazing. So take, take that away and make sure this week, get out there, get in front of potential clients. I mean, Sean Clark just told us Amy's got it all in the training as well. He confirmed basically yeah. all the training that Amy's already <laughs> doing. You know, you, you, you know, the guy himself said, basically do all this. And Amy's like, I'm already telling you how to do this and giving you more and showing you much more detail how to do it all. So go check that out. Go, go, go get it. Go get in front of clients because that's how you're going to build your business um, and go from there. Have an awesome week. And we will see you next time. Bye, guys.